Finally, my little exercise. So just go with me here, guys. So I've gone to Tim Solinsky, which is out of state the last two years, and PDGA World Pro Masters the last two years. All these guys are coming up to me, and gals, are coming up to me and saying how awesome the Las Vegas club has become. They come to the Las Vegas Challenge, they come to the Halloween, they read your Facebook posts, and they can't believe how much we have grown and become such a unit, because that wasn't the case 20 years ago. So kudos to everyone who helps make our sport and our club grow, and here's the little exercise. If you have helped in any way run a, a, any type of event out here for the Las Vegas Disc Golf Club, or an informal challenge, or setting up a course, or selling fundraiser discs, or doing anything you can, anyone who's participated in any type of that type of activity, can I please have you just come stand right over here? Anyone who's helped out, please get out the sun. <laughs> anything, you've helped at all. T pads, volunteer spotting at tournaments. Set up Lee Canyon, set up Black Mountain, anything. Being on a board, digging tee pads, showing kids how to play, set up stuff at your school, break stack, are you out there? Baxter? So guys, this is the reason why our sport rocks. Give him a huge hand, please. Yeah, that's also you and Scott. So don't forget. Yeah, so now we're going to narrow this down. Please don't move. If you have ran a formal TD event or you've been on the board, please remain standing. If you have ran a formal PDGA event, been on a board, please remain standing. Woo! Let's give these guys give another these guys hand, guys. So I went to the last board meeting. Besides the board, it was just me. And these guys have a hard time. People like to talk smack about the decisions the board's doing. It changes every year. They're doing their best to try to make everyone happy. The problem is you can't make everyone happy. So if you guys have a concern with the board decision or how an event's being ran, instead of griping to your friends and doing the bashing on the side, grab them, pull them to the side, and just give them an earful if you can. Maybe they can't make the change, maybe they can. But these are the guys that are really trying to promote the sport. So out of these guys, there's one gentleman that is really why we're all here. So if you reinitiated the club, after the club was kind of dying, if you got us courses on a wild horse, and if you're getting us a course in Boulder City, please Woo! remain standing. <laughs> He's been fighting leukemia for a couple years now, if you didn't know that. He is really the one why we have reinitiated the club. Him and Kerry Trotter started again in 2008 after it was dying. He's, he has all this energy. He has worked family disc golf. That's his priorities. So on behalf of the Las Vegas Challenge and any of the champion discs, they will be paying for Ricker to be going to the USDGC and playing on behalf of the Los Angeles. <laughs>